This is action principle number four. Follow through. Follow through is that wonderful quality of the successful person that says, I not only make a promise, but you know, when I make a promise, I deliver. You can count on me. As a parent, as a teacher, as a business person, I will be there. Even if later I find out I got to do a little more work than I thought, or maybe I have to take a little less, I don't want you to worry. You don't have to worry. I will be there. Let me tell you a little story about Vivian. Vivian was one of the greatest real estate agents that I ever met. Vivian was a little old lady. She had a small one-room real estate office. This one-room real estate office, the walls were lined with file cabinets. She had another little old lady who answered her phone. And she had her old husband, Al. Al had arthritis and was, you know, kind of bent over at the spine. Two old ladies, one old man, and a one-room real estate office. And they made more money in real estate than two dozen average real estate agents. They made, they didn't sell, they made over a million dollars every year. See, in those file cabinets was personal information on all of her clients. Names, names of children, birthdays, anniversaries. Here's what Vivian did. On every occasion, she or Al or the secretary sent a card. Vivian's business was confined, concentrated, focused on the sale of waterfront properties in just two towns on Cape Cod in Massachusetts. Really, no more than a few hundred homes. Yet she knew everything there was to know about those homes, who owned them, when they bought them, what they paid. She went out of her way to meet every one of those owners and to pledge personal service to them. Almost all of those people owning those waterfront homes were wealthy. Some of these people only use those homes for a few weeks of vacation every summer. The rest of the year, should they worry about their properties? No. Vivian was on the lookout for any problems. Over the years, Vivian developed such trust with these owners that she had the keys for most of those houses. Before the owners arrived every year for their vacations, Vivian would check the houses and put in milk and juice in the refrigerator. If you had to have work done, contractors would go to Vivian for the key. If you called up and you needed to be picked up from the airport, call Vivian. She'd send Al. There was never any charge for these follow-through services. Today, when I teach real estate agents about selling real estate, I always tell them the Vivian story. And when I do, <laughs> You can just see a lot of them, their eyes just glaze over. <laughs> this guy talking about file cabinets? What are they? <laughs> hey, today we're agents in, you know, 21st century. We have automated, auto, automated contact management programs. <laughs> we don't need file cabinets. <laughs> today, in those two towns on Cape Cod, there are at least six offices filled with agents trying to do what that one little old lady used to do with her old secretary and her old husband.